crooked commie taunts Trump camp over Mueller indictment and cryptic tweet. A Twitter account by the name of Reinhold Niebuhr, run by former FBI Director James Comey, has been sending out a series of cryptic tweets over the last several days. As the Gateway Pundit previously reported, James Comey admitted that he was secretly on Twitter and Instagram. In March, Gizmodo figured out which account he was operating in stealth. Well, not so stealth anymore. The sleuth at Gizmodo, Ashley Feinberg, was tipped off by Comey's own words regarding his Twitter and Instagram. I care deeply about privacy, treasure it. I have an Instagram account with nine followers. Nobody is getting in. They're all immediate relatives and one daughter's serious boyfriend. I let them in because they're serious enough. I don't want anybody looking at my photos. I treasure my privacy and security on the internet. My job is public safety. After finding one of Comey's sons on Instagram, a request was made to follow the account. Instagram then suggests other people to follow based on an algorithm that tracks other people associated with this account. Oops. The name Reinhold Niebuhr popped up. A quick Google search of Reinhold Niebuhr revealed. By senior year, Comey was a double major in religion and chemistry, writing a senior thesis on theologian Reinhold Niebuhr and televangelist Jerry Falwell and on his way to the University of Chicago Law School. The name Reinhold Niebuhr ultimately led the investigation to the Twitter account which is usually protected from public viewing. Strange how the FBI director can't even cover his own tracks on social media. On Wednesday afternoon, the Reinhold Niebuhr Twitter account, presumably run by James Comey sent out a very rare tweet in what appeared to be a response to President Trump's tweet storm slamming the former FBI director. Comey's tweet from Wednesday, beautiful fall day at West Point. Lone kayaker on the Hudson. Many people interpreted this as a Benedict Arnold reference. Comey's confidant and longtime friend Benjamin Witz tweeted about it too. Thursday afternoon, the Reinhold Niebuhr Twitter account posted another picture with the caption, Little Round Top, Gettysburg. Good place to think about leadership and values. Civil War reference. On Friday evening, Comey's alleged Twitter account sent out a tweet with a picture of a very tall man standing in an Iowa in cornfield saying, Good to be back in Iowa. Sunday, Comey's Reinhold Niebuhr Twitter account sent out another tweet with a picture of pelicans flying and the caption read, Watching migrating white pelicans in Iowa thinking about Niebuhr's serenity prayer. Many people are interpreting this as a reference to the 1993 movie Pelican Brief. In this movie, the President of the United States is outed for telling the FBI to back down about an investigation and gets caught. His chief of staff resigns and he doesn't run for a second term. Funny, Comey is actually describing the Obama administration and himself. The traitors were all in the Obama administration with an equally corrupt FBI, CIA and Congress. On Monday, Reinhold Niebuhr tweeted a photo of James Comey, wearing a blue long sleeve shirt with gray pants, standing in the middle of a road in Iowa. Goodbye Iowa. On the road home. Got to get back to writing. We'll try to tweet in useful ways. Now this. On Sunday, Comey tweeted an MLK quote, We are in an inescapable network of mutuality, tied in a single garment of destiny. Whatever affects one directly, affects all indirectly. The full MLK quote, Injustice anywhere is a threat to justice everywhere. We are caught in an inescapable network of mutuality, tied in a single garment of destiny. Whatever affects one directly, affects all indirectly. Comey tweeted this on the eve of Mueller issuing his first indictment related to the Russian collusion investigation. Rumors are flying about Paul Manafort being the target of Monday's indictment. Manafort was a part of Trump's campaign early on. Mueller is however looking into wire transfers Manafort sent to foreign countries back in 2012 and 2013 years before Trump's presidential campaign. Comey is taunting Trump's camp with this tweet saying they are all connected and if one of Trump's people goes down it will affect all of them in one way or another. What does Comey know, Comey know?